Hey everyone, here we are at Little Maddie Campground. Little Maddie Campground is fourth in our series featuring the five campgrounds in the John Rudy Recreation Area. The Rudy Recreation Area is located in the Frying Pan River Valley, 15 miles east of Basalt, Colorado. Aspen is 33 miles away, and Glenwood Springs is probably about 38 miles from here. There's nearly 90 campsites between these five campgrounds. Four of the campgrounds are close to the marina, and one campground is at the far east end of the lake. Like the first three campgrounds we have visited, Little Maddie is near the marina, but it is most secluded of the four so far. A quick recap of the three previous campgrounds we visited. We had the Rudy Marina Campground, which was eight campsites all in a row near the boat ramp and the uh, boat trailer parking. Those sites were great for large RVs, but since boat trailers are not allowed in any of the other campgrounds, the parking lot is always busy. This does make Rudy Marina Campground one of the last ones to fill up and a good possibility if you can't get reservations at one of the other sites. Next we featured Little Mod Campground, which was the closest to the marina and the most popular one at the reservoir. Its 22 sites were also good for the bigger RVs. And then we had the Molly B Campground, which was 26 campsites, with a number of those having views of the reservoir. Rudy Reservoir covers nearly 1,000 acres and 12 miles of shoreline. Its proximity to Aspen and Glenwood Springs, along with boating, sailing, fishing, and swimming, make it a popular destination, especially on the weekends. Our camera's GPS didn't work for this video, so we don't have the usual overlays at the bottom of the screen. We'll pass back by sites 1 through 14 again on the way back out, so you'll be able to get a second look at those sites. Elevation at Little Matty Campground is 7815. We've got 19 campsites. $23 per night with a 14-day stay limit. And out of the first four videos that we've done here at Rudy Recreation Area, this is the first one that does not accept reservations. All sites are first come, first served. And so far this has the shortest uh, vehicle length. Uh, there's a 22-foot maximum trailer length here. Like the other campgrounds at Rudy Reservoir, there is no cell service here with either Verizon or AT&T. You have to go back down to Basalt to get signal. Campsite number one is the only one at Little Matty Campground that has views of Rudy Reservoir. Coming up here in a minute, we'll pass the Molly B Campground, followed by the RV Dump Station, which is $10. And then we'll pass the Little Mod Campground, and then they turn off for uh, Rudy Marina Campground as we make our way back to the highway. Hey, be sure to check out the description below this video for additional information about this campground and the surrounding area. If you're viewing from a mobile device, such as a cell phone or a tablet, you'll have to click on the drop down arrow that's on the right side, just below where the video is playing, and that will pull up the video description. 
So inside the video description we include some information that we don't always remember to mention while we're recording the video. Um, and we also include a link to a Google map that we've created that shows all of the campgrounds that we've created videos for. On that map you can click on any pin on the map and get a link to the video for that campground. Other stuff that's included in the video description is uh, campground pricing information, reservation status that'll let you know if the campground allows reservations or if it's a first come first serve campground. We also try to mention site numbers that are pull through sites because not everybody likes to back in their RV. We include max RV length and occasionally we'll mention the location of the nearest RV dump station as well. You can also find season dates as far as when the campground typically opens and closes and cell phone coverage for both Verizon and AT&T. Sometimes we will mention area activities such as historic places, hiking or ATV trails, or places for wildlife viewing. We also include basic directions on how to get to the campground, as well as GPS coordinates. Thanks for watching. Have a blessed day.